Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, the place to be where you can develop your creative skills. And in today's video, we're going to learn how to place an image onto text in InDesign. It's really a cool effect to enhance your graphic designs. And if you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe for more design tips like this. So let's hop into InDesign. So let's start with text tool over here. Hit on a type tool and then draw the box and type in your text, right? And let's change the font into a nice thicker and larger one so we can see the image better. So let's try impact, which is a really nice font and about 150. And that's about it. There you go. So all right. Here's what you're going to do next. Make sure that your text is still selected, like this one. Then go to Type menu and click on Create Outlines. So what it's going to do is make this text into an image box. So next is we'll put an image on it. So you can either hit Command or Control D or go to File and click on Place. Then select your image and there you go. You can also resize the image or move around to place it better on your text by double clicking on your text, this, and you'll be able to see this um, uh, brown colored box. I'll show you this one here. I hope you can see it clearly. And you can um, resize this one, see how it changes the image inside the text, and you can also move this around however you like. You can also resize the whole text actually. Like this. And the cool thing about this is you can do a few more things to make this better than it already is. Like putting a stroke on it by going to your stroke panel here. And choose your color or whatever color you have. Example this one. And increase the weight of the stroke over here. So maybe six. And you can make it as thick or as thin as you want it. And you can also change the color. So that's it. And there you go. There's another quick and easy design style for you. And if you've got a question or a comment, please drop those down below. And I hope you found this video useful. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this. Yeah. There you have it, guys. And uh, as always, if you've enjoyed watching this tutorial, make sure to subscribe, like, comment, and share this with your friends. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!